The formula for the area of a triangle is area equals one half times the length of the base times the length of its height. Another way of writing this is area equals base times height over two. It just depends on your math book which way they're going to present it. The most important thing is to correctly identify the base and height of the triangle. The height is where I like to start. It's going to be a line that starts at a corner, goes to the opposite side, and forms a right angle. That right angle is your big clue that it is the height. The side that it goes into is your base. So in this case, Area would equal one half times the base, which is 10 inches, and the height, which is six inches. One half times 10 is five, five times six is 30, and we would finish it with inches squared. Two little scenarios to look out for. In this case here on the left, the right angle is visible, but there's not this little dotted line. The line, the height, is a part of the triangle in this case. But the same basic rule applies. It starts at a corner, it goes to the opposite side, and it forms a right angle. So 12 is my height. The side that it goes into down here, 7 is the base. This one's probably the most strange of them all. In this case, the height is outside of the triangle, but still it is starting at a corner. It's going to where this side would go if it were extended. The key, it is forming a right angle. That's what you're looking for. So the height in this case would be nine and the base is just this bit. It does not include that bit. It is only that bottom side of that triangle. So 14 in this case. If you would like a more in-depth explanation for why and how this works, as well as some full examples, please click on the long form video linked in the description below. And if this was helpful or useful in any way, please like, share, or subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye.